Hi guys, Dave Paul here. Just wanted to take a 60 seconds to say, you know, it really is important that you follow your dreams and chase your dreams with passion. I don't know if you have people around you telling you that or people around you saying, you know, just go to school, get a job, work for someone for 40 years, retire and die. That's the joke that my mentor said to me that I thought, that's true. That's how I'm taught. And I've gone to college, grad school. I racked up, you know, uh, all the school loans you can imagine. Um, for me, it was just like, okay, what do I want to do? I, I love working online. I love the health and fitness. And I've been able to meld those two together. And it's just amazing. So, you know, I don't know if I, what I do is what you want to do, but fi find out what that passion is. Find out what excites you and follow that. And it's really important that you not listen to what I call the dream stealers or the naysayers. I mean, they're everywhere. Uh, and you, and the, the worst ones are the ones that are closest to you because they, you know, what, what really why they tend to rain on your dreams a little bit is just because what I was told, it makes sense now, is they don't want you to take away their excuse for their sort of mediocre life. If you succeed, if you actually do it, not even, you don't have to succeed, just seeing you happy doing what you want to do. Again, I'm not saying quit your job. I'm not saying stop going to school. I'm not saying, you know, stop doing all the things you're doing, but start to fit something else in. You know, I have something I offer people. Find, find a mentor. I mentor a lot of people. I've been in this industry for many years. Um, you know, find a good mentor, a coach that will work with you in some kind of system or business that, you know, has some uh, track record. Or if it's just your own thing, it doesn't need a track record. The track record is that you're passionate about it. You've been passionate about it for many years, and you'll find a way to make that happen. So, I, you know, I live my life. I see people being their dream, having their dreams taken away from them by other people. But we don't want to have them taken away. We allow them to take them away. <laughs> and I just want to be a voice in your life. Maybe you haven't heard of this for a month or a year. To say, go for it. You know, it's your life. Um, I love that post. I just posted it called, your opinion will not cut me a check. When you listen to other people's opinions, you know, they're not going to pay your bills. All right? They're not going to live your life for you. So you have to make that decision. What do you want to do? What excites you? You know, start you know, maybe write down some different options for yourself. If you're already in a business, you know, maybe you need to go back to the drawing board of what your dreams are, what your why. It's very important you get a why that makes you cry, and one that gets you so excited you cry tears of joy over it. So, all right, guys, I'm going to sign off here. Thanks for listening. Have a great day.